this is how to play Same Old, Same Old by the Civil Wars. Uh, this one's a little bit tricky. Um, and it'll take some getting used to because I think he does use a pick, but he does some finger picking like uh, motions with this because he still does both the bass note and starts the little melody part at the same time. And you can do that just by holding the pick and then picking also with your middle finger. Um, but to get started, this is in dad gad tuning and it's capo 3. So go ahead and tune down to D A D G A D. Okay? And then capo 3. <clears throat> so to start basically you're starting the very first note is both the bass note and the third string from the top. And then you're hammering on with your middle finger or whatever you're comfortable with onto the second fret of the third string from the top. And here I think he actually either hammers on or picks again for the for the fourth up to the fourth fret. But I, I like the sound of of this sliding up to the fourth. Really it's whatever you prefer. They both sound good. So you hammer on to the second fret, up to the fourth, and then open on the fourth fret um, string from the top. So. so once you hit that open, then you go back to the fourth fret, and you're sliding back down, and then you're pulling off to open. So. And then you go. And that's just hammering on to the second fret of the second string from the top. And he, he does kind of a like a light um, background walk up the fret. And that's not really as important, but he does it. And then you do the same thing, you're just pulling off. You go. And then you're repeating. Well, it does, once again, it does. It has that light hitting of the uh, third string from the top and the fifth string from the top. And then it goes back into. And the second time it slides from, instead of going back down, it slides from the second fret up to the fifth. Okay, and then he just repeats that twice. Um, it's a tricky intro, but once you get it, it's... Uh, it's not too bad. It's just getting that pick. You can either come back down with the pick and hit that full string from the top or hit it again with your uh, middle finger, whatever you're better with. Okay. Um, now the verse is very quiet, especially in the beginning, but basically it's... All I've been doing at least is putting my middle basically just holding down the second fret of the third string from the bottom and then just kept giving more emphasis on the bass note and then it goes to the second fret of the second string from the top and then it's going to the fourth fret of the second string from the top and this time you're changing your finger finally to the second fret of the third string from the top. Back to the open. Now right before Joy sings, you do a little so it's just hammer on to the second fret of the second string from the top and then back to open. And then it repeats. This is you, you kind of hit that second and you go up to the fifth on the low E, and what I've been hitting is the uh, the fourth fret on the third string from the bottom. And then back to the open that you started with, and this is just fourth fret, 
the second string from the top, and then the second fret of both the third and fourth string from the top. Back up to fifth. And all that's just, at least this is once again what I've been doing because it's hard to tell exactly what he's doing in this song, so. I'm just doing a walking bass line of second, uh, second fret, second string from the top, open second string, and then second string of the E, fourth string of the E, and then up to the fifth, and then going back to this little, whatever this chord would be. And then it goes back into the intro. Um, that's pretty much m most of the song. Um, there is a part right before the little bridge that, uh, this is what I've been playing. It's probably not right, but at least it's the right bass note. <laughs> um, so going up to the sixth fret, so it's that build up, and you'll be able to recognize. And then... Back to the fifth fret. Then it goes to the second fret. This is all the bridge. And then uh, you'll have to check me on this, but I think it goes to that or or to that. I can't remember that part. So just comment about the bridge, and I'll, I'll figure it out and help you. But um. That's pretty much it. This is a confusing one to try to teach just because it's so much telling your where your fingers go because being dropped or dad get tuning, I don't know the chords. I can only tell you where my fingers are going. So anyway, that is the uh, gist of it. Um, if you have specific questions, I'll try to help. But um, I sang with this and it works. It's not going to be note for note for what uh, they do, but it's definitely close enough. So uh, good luck with it. And like I said, if you have any questions, go ahead and comment. See you.